Sugod na ta! Problem 2.14. Obtain V1 through V3 in the circuit of figure 2.78. So first, let's assume the direction of your voltage drop from positive to negative. Next, assume the direction of your voltage supply from negative to positive. Then we will create a loop. So this would be your loop 1, loop 2, and this would be your loop 3. So at loop 1, we have the voltage just drop of V1 and V2. So your V1 having the same direction of your loop 1, so that would be positive V1. Then your V2 opposes the direction of your loop, so therefore it would be a negative V2 is equal to the voltage supply, which is 24 volts, and having the same direction with your loop, so therefore it would be positive 24 volts. And this would be your equation 1. So at loop 2, so across your loop 2, so you have the voltage drops of V2 and V3. So your V2 and V3 having the same direction with your loop, so therefore it would be a positive V2 and V3. So you have V2 plus V3 is equal to the summation of voltage supplies then you have a voltage supply of 12 volts which opposes the direction of your L2 so therefore it would be negative 12 and this would be your equation 2 at loop 3 so across your loop 3 you have a voltage drop of V3 opposes the direction of your loop so you have negative V3 is equal to the voltage supply, so you have 10 volts opposes the direction of your loop, so therefore it would be a negative 10. So divide both sides by negative 1, so you have V3 is equal to 10 volts. So we have the value of your V3, so we can solve for your V2. So to solve for your V2, you have the equation of V2 plus V3 is equal to negative 12. Substitute the value of your V3, which is 10 volts. So you have V2 plus 10 is equal to negative 12. Transpose 10 to the right-hand side. So you have V2 is equal to negative 12 minus 10. So V2 is equal to negative 22 volts. Now we have the value for your V2. Then we can solve for your V1. So to solve for your V1, we have the equation of V1 minus V2 is equal to 24 volts. Substitute the value of your V2. So you have V1 minus negative 22 is equal to 24 volts. Or we have V1 plus 22 is equal to 24 volts. Transpose your 22 to the right hand side. So therefore we have V1 is equal to 24 minus 22. So you have V1 is equal to 2 volts.